I came out this afternoon to fill these two pots up in my newly formed garden. Look how it's coming along. Of course now I've got to be able to distinguish the weeds from the green manure. Probably not much difference. Anyway, I had my waste all here ready to go in and the ibis and a crow came over and decided to have a look and knocked over this old yogurt all over the floor. Never mind. I'll find a way to clean it up. The other interesting thing I wanted to show you is when I did this garden the other week, I did this end section covered in sugarcane mulch. And look at this huge hole down the side here that something has dug up. And I'm sure it is that sugarcane mulch because you would think that if someone was looking for something to eat, they'd go for this here with all the seeds just loose on the top, barely below the surface. Nothing there, nothing's being touched. But that big hole in the sugarcane mulch is huge. And I don't think that's a bush turkey because it's too deep. I'm almost sure that's a rat. And speaking of rats, someone's been killing them in the neighbourhood and poisoning them. Because I found another one the other day and he's been in this pot. I just put some orange peel in there, mandarin peel in there. You can see the remnants of the second rat there too. And now that I'm wanting to grow things in this garden, I don't think I'm going to be wanting to put dead rats in there anymore. But this is all green manure and it'll get all turned back into soil anyway, so it doesn't matter. So here is one bucket of waste. And a few chicken things. Ooh. It's a bit tragic how everything in our house seems to go bad before we get to eat it. We're not very good. And I've got some nice grass clippings to put on there. Stick that on top of there for fun. Not sure that I need it. So I've got some lavash bread. Which look has just gone mouldy as I said. Everything in my house goes mouldy before we get to eat it. Look at this. A whole bag of bread. But I love bread for the soldier flies if you're wanting to feed your chickens or something. Because it makes it turns beautiful and like I want to say it white. all this mess up, put the bread to good use. And I can wash the rest of that away. Now let's go to the other pot. I threw some grass clippings on this during the week. Put that bread in first. And then I'll put the rest of the yogurt in that's gone bad. Terrible, such a waste. I keep telling my son not to buy such a big container. He says, oh, but I'm going to use it, Mum. Never does. And look how bad this is. See all the mould on the top here? I just don't get time. I keep saving my waste to show you all these videos, and then, of course, it just gets to the point of no return like this. Terrible. I'll go and rinse that out later. And I think I'll put the bread in another one on its own. This is full enough. <laughs> Let's see if that makes my little plants, my new little seedlings grow better. 
cold bone. There we go. Thanks for watching.